Welcome back to Odom's Homestead down here in Zone 7A, Tennessee. Today we're going to be doing the Back to Our Roots Sun Tea Challenge. And yeah, let's gather some of these herbs and start making this tea. Bit of this uh, chocolate mix. Just a little too. We'll be using stems and all. Cut the tops off because they're going to flower. We'll be using stems and all. I just believe in uh, see all the nutrients that goes to them leaves flow up and down this stem. So it has most of the nutrients in it. So I, I usually chop mine up into pieces. And put them off in my teeth. Get more nutrition values that way. Now, next, we're going to get one of my all time favorite, what I always got to have, and that's some lemon balm. This is my lemon balm right here. You can see she is going to flower. Yeah. It don't take much of lemon balm either. I'm going to take three stems for them. See, stalks and all. Right beside is some. Uh, oregano, but look at that rose of Sharon's. Oh, I got y'all here. Let me touch y'all up a little bit so you can see that rose of Sharon. She is beautiful. She is beautiful. Next up, say guava, that pink guava right here. We gonna take one of her leaves. We're gonna take. We're gonna take a couple from the bottom. Just a couple. Yes, yeah, a couple. Now we're gonna go over here and get us a, a fig leaf, a couple fig leaves to add to our tea. Here's the figs. Yeah. But not just 
keep it from going everywhere. I know I gotta fish it out. And my base, I'm gonna use a green tape. I love green tape. And I'm just using one because I don't want the green tea to overpower my herbs and my fig leaf and my guava leaf. So I'm just gonna use one. Back at you in a few hours. We'll see how it goes. I'm gonna leave it right here. A little bit cloudy over day right now. We'll see in a few hours. See y'all. See y'all in a little bit. All right. It's been about four hours later. This is what I teed looks like. Oh, you got a lid on this. That smells good. That smells good. See what you can taste in this mm. I think actually you can taste that fig more than any. But it's delicious. Love y'all.